Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're all doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 notification video. In this video, I would like to cover the atomic shot. What do we have today? And afterwards, we're going to take a look at the daily challenges, see what we got to do in order to make some score. So let's stop wasting time and jump right into it. Alright, so let's navigate to the Atomic Shop and see what we got today. So today for the Atomic Shop, if we scroll all the way down to the last section, we can see that we got the Free States Vending Machine Bundle with a 30% discount. Hey, 30% discount. Not good enough. Mm -mm. 50 would be better, but... I might even just gonna wait for the for the bundle to come arrive and get a bundle with a bigger discount. I mean, this is a very old item now. It should get real high discounts, like minimum 50%, my personal opinion. But anyway, uh, throughout the week, by the way, we'll be having a lot of different uh, vending machines, which I didn't mention on the Tuesday's video uh, on the Atomic Shop reset. Or maybe I did. But basically, today is Free States, tomorrow is Raiders, Nuka Cola, then Coffin, Winter, and Vendor Science. That's what we're going to have. So I'm going to cover it throughout the entire week. So stay put. <laughs> Alright, since we got the Atomic Shop covered, let's go and check out the daily. So for the daily, what you got to do is buy or sell an item from another player, uh, collect a bubble head, uh, complete an event. Uh, gold star is complete any of the dailies and this will trigger automatically once you do all five uh, Kill a legendary enemy kill a scorched uh, Level up one time in nuclear winter deploy uh, The camp that's actually an easy one. Oh wait. I'm not even gonna do these. I'm rank 100 <laughs> I just hit it yesterday and plant a Crop in a workshop or camp Okay now, all these are pretty much straightforward. Uh, if you're a new player, then buying or selling, you don't really have to trade with another player. You can do that in the public uh, world. You go to a vending machine of another player, and you can and you need to complete three transactions. So you just gotta buy three items. Or the easiest way and the cheapest way is to buy one bullet, buy another bullet, and another bullet, and this gets completed. Bobblehead is a real pain because these things are random now for the new players area I would recommend <clears throat> the vault agricultural research center inside I used to use I used to get a lot of bubble heads over there and since these things are randomized it's pretty hard to tell you where you can get a bubble head by the way if you can also get a bubble head in the land view lighthouse once you spawn in on the right side but once again it's not a uh, hundred percent guaranteed what I would do recommend in case if you have uh, this perk card in the perception or actually I would recommend you getting one and it's called the uh, bubblehead finder <laughs> I can't even pronounce that thing damn it anyway this will trigger that whenever a bubblehead is near you will hear some sound and you'll be able to find it so have that on today and hopefully you'll find a bubblehead uh, in case of, I, I ain't gonna do it. Well, I don't have to do it anymore. <laughs> Which means I don't even have to play this game anymore. But that's the. <laughs> Here's an idea: return the uh, atom rewards for those who rank 100. All right. So, bubble ahead. Uh, complete event. Straightforward. Uh, anything on the map, you see an event, go do it, and you will get it done. I think that also counts towards the public events. So, just do an event, and you're done. Uh, this already explained. Kill a legendary also is pretty straightforward. You just kill a legendary enemy, right? If you're a lower player, uh, you can have a quest event triggering over here. It's uh, you gotta kill some alpha wolves. I for really forgot how it's called. Uh, basically, you'll have three legendaries over there. Really good place to farm le le like n newbie le um, level legendaries for yourself. Uh, also, you can. Well, if you see a public event and you see people joining it, uh, join it as well. Your task is to shoot the legendary before it gets killed. And so if you shoot it and a higher level kills it, you still get the legendary loot plus you get that completed. All right, then what else do we have? <clears throat> well, level up, 
all you gotta do is level up, deploy a camp, I'll explain, and crop in the workshop I'll explain. Let's go with Scorched. Uh, Scorched, the best place for lower levels would be the Morgantown Airport. There's a whole bunch of them. And, uh, and just go there and you'll get it done. <laughs> or uh, Morgantown High School. But if you see they're all dead, maybe server hop. And basically this is the best area to find the Scorched. Uh, -da -da. Planting crop, I would recommend you capturing this workshop right here in case if you do not have like a, anything to plant uh, over here, there's a whole bunch of corn, everything, you name it. Pick it up, capture the workshop, build, done. <laughs> so super simple, easy. And deploy camp in nuclear winter, even though if you don't like playing nuclear winter, I would recommend you doing it because it's very easy. All you got to do is... Uh, log into the lobby, then wait for the game to start. Then once the game start, all you gotta do is spam. I mean, spam, <laughs> spam the camp. Uh, place the camp three times. So you place it, open. You open this menu again. You place it again. You place it again. Done. Uh, although, uh, a little warning on top. Sometimes these nuclear winter causes bugs and auto completion. So. I would highly recommend not doing that when the time is very close to the reset and if you actually did play Nuclear Winter, make sure to fully restart your game like completely. Restart it. Uh, I haven't had the auto completion bug happening to me for a couple of weeks now and if it happens to me now I don't care because <laughs> I'm rank 100 and uh, that's it. I'm <laughs> just gonna go do my daily scream and get the hell out of here. Alright Z Clan and everybody else, I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below, please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody see them, I see them, I read them and I delete them. Have that in mind. If you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Soul from Ukraine, so hi from Ukraine. Our clan has grown to 5,799 Z Clan members. We do have an active Discord channel, the link is down in the video description. Also I've created the tutorial on how to use it because uh, Fallout 76 is not the only game that we play so if you want to get access to the correct chats and in general understand how to maneuver through our discord uh, I highly recommend watching the tutorial because our discord is over 600 members right now and we're still growing getting daily members logging in joining in our clan and we play games many different type of game man <laughs> alright thanks all for watching you all have a good morning day and night whatever you guys lock in at and I'll see you later bye From the ashes we rose, into the future we'll go. We are the clan, we have a gamer's soul. By the might of the sword, we put the pen to the test. We are the clan, we are the gamer's best. Z clan, Z clan. Oh, our hearts and our soul, we will forever know. Our community strong, oh, this is our song. To the depths of the heart.